Hey, this is Lori with HappyNaturalHorse.com, and this is Dominic. He is my Appaloosa gelding. He was given to me about four years ago. Five, yeah, four years ago. He had a knee, and his knee is completely gone. And today, I want to rant on horse owners. Um, I don't really want to make you feel bad, but lately, I've been getting a lot of emails and consultations on people that um, have a lot of I have a lot of issues with their horses, mainly um, digestion issues. And I want to make you aware, even though it's on my website, on how to feed a horse, people just think that, you know, I don't know if you think that I think that, you might think that I'm an idiot because I haven't gone to school. Well, I want to tell you something. I have been going, I have been studying horse nutrition for the last 13 years. I did go to school on it. And really, Wapedia tells you that horses are herbivores, okay? You got that, people? They're herbivores, okay? That means they're plant-based, okay? They don't have oil, they don't have canola oil, they don't have corn oil, they don't eat soy products, they don't eat beet pulp, and your beet pulp is genetically modified. So I want to let you know, as a horse owner, not making you wrong, if you have health issues, especially digestive issues with your horses, you gotta take a look at your diet. Okay, you just got to take a look at your diet. And um, it's very, very important that you feed your horse as close to nature as you can and not buy into the propaganda of buying commercial feed. Your commercial feed is genetically modified. It's highly processed. So the horse has a really hard time digesting. And so you go, well, how does my horse gain weight? He gains weight off of hay. He gains weight off of grass. Well, how do I prevent him from having insulin resistance or Cushing's or laminitis on the grass? You have to get them naturally mined minerals. Now, there's if you don't want to give them the big sky minerals, which co covers 90% of what the horse needs for the digestion, none of these horses, um, they're out on pasture for 24 seven, so is my pony. They, I don't have a problem with laminitis or Cushing's or anything like that. In fact, I fixed my horses. I fixed them. I mean, he had a knee, it's completely gone. He's totally sound. Um, I've had horses come in here with ulcers and they heal up quickly with just hay and bentonite clay and the big sky. So take a look at your labels and take a look at what you're putting inside your horse. I don't know what else to tell you. You know, read your labels. HappyNaturalHorse.com. Share those with somebody that you care about. Bye.